Hello Creative Gems, welcome to Creativity. If you like pineapples and glam decor, then today's craft tutorial is made especially for you. Today we're going to feature three glass jars that we will transform into beautiful pineapple table decor that can double as vases as well as candle holders. For our first piece, we will take this glass jar I found at the dollar store and turn it into a one-of-a-kind pineapple candle holder. This jar comes with a wider base that gets gradually narrower as you approach the opening. It also has an interesting vertical ridge that gives the jar a bit of character. The jar also comes with a lid which we will not be using for this craft, but be sure to keep the lid aside for a future craft project. In order to create the leaves for our pineapples, we will be using a couple of packs of these silver plastic spoons, also from the dollar store. These come in a 24 pack, so you'll likely need a couple to complete all three pieces today. And for an extra glam look, we'll, we will be adding some gem embellishments as well. This pack of different size clear round gems is from Hobby Lobby and it will last you literally years. We're also going to be incorporating these two pieces. You may recognize the large round cap as it is the lid of a Tropicana juice jug. For our three pineapple pieces, we are going with a silver theme. So we're going to cover the two white plastic pieces with a silver metallic marker to give them more of a silver chrome finish. And here is what the plastic pieces look like now. You can see that on the surface there is a reflective finish on it that will blend nicely in the background with the spoons. Now we're going to add a very tiny dollop of hot glue to the edge of the Tropicana cap. Let the glue cool halfway and then sit it upside down on top of the glass jar opening. We don't necessarily need it to stick to the opening but just enough so that it doesn't slip off. Next we add the second piece inside the center. You'll see later why these two pieces are needed. In the meantime, let's take a pack of the silver plastic spoons and break off the round part of the spoon. We won't need the arm part of the spoon, but keep them aside for a future craft project. With the round parts, we're going to embellish them with the clear round gems. For that, I'm going to use this gem picker tool to help me grasp the gems and place them onto the spoon surface. We start with adhering three large round gems vertically onto the bottom of the spoon surface. Then on either side, two smaller round gems. You'll need a whole bunch as, as these spoons will make up the leaves of the pineapple. And while we continue to work on the spoons, I would like to take a moment to thank you for tuning in to today's craft project. If you enjoy glam home decor and DIY crafts on a budget, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on any of my glam home decor DIYs. And if you like what you see today, please give me a thumbs up as well. Your support will help me continue providing you with more amazing and creative craft tutorials. You'll see that when the light hits the gems, it glimmers and shines beautifully. I have also embellished these spoons for many of my other craft projects to make lamps, trays, and other decor pieces. If you would like to see those other pieces, I'll leave links in my description box to the tutorials for those other pieces. Here I'm starting to build out the leaves on the pineapple's crown, but adhering each spoon tip to the rim of the glass jar. You'll want to mimic the positioning of the leaves by securing them on a slight slant. Let the hot glue cool before moving on to the next spoon tip.
Once the first round of spoon tips are secured to the jar, work your way up. The next round of spoon tips should be adhered to the Tropicana lid. As you complete each round of spoon tips, the pineapple crown should get narrower and narrower towards the top of the opening. You'll see here that I am now placing the spoons without gems as I didn't make enough with the gems, but I think this design is just as pretty and offers a mirror-like finish towards the top of the pineapple crown. And as you work towards the top, the spoon tip should slant more vertically than the lower ones. You can see that our jar is really starting to look like a pineapple. I really think the silver spoon tips make beautiful leaves for the crown of the pineapple, don't you think? And here, I think, will be the final round of spoon tips for our pineapple crown. Okay, so maybe one more round of spoon tips and then we should be done with the crown. Now that the crown of the pineapple is complete, we could keep it as is, or we could bling out the base of the pineapple. Of course, I have chosen to add some more bling using these small clear gem stickers I found at the dollar store. Here, I'm applying them vertically, aligning them to the vertical ridges of the glass jar. And here's the final look for our first pineapple jar. I have placed a battery operated LED tea light candle on top. You could also opt to remove the crown and place a tea light inside the glass jar as well. At night, the glowing flame coming from the tea light inside the glass jar will look beautiful and provide a nice ambiance to the entire room. For our second pineapple decor piece, we are going to use a mason jar. This one is actually an old classical spaghetti sauce jar that I cleaned up. We are going to follow the same process as our first pineapple decor piece, but for this one, we're going to start from the rim of the opening and then work our way down the length of the jar. This time, the spoon tips will be positioned in a way to mimic the skin or scaly base of the pineapple.
Here's what it looks like so far. Towards the very bottom of the mason jar, we're going to glam it up with some rhinestone ribbon. It is a small detail, but I think it will make a big difference on the overall glam factor of this pineapple decor piece. And here's the final look for our second pineapple decor piece. Here I am using it as a vase holding some flowers. It is also sitting on top of a mirrored candle holder I made separately by embellishing a dollar store mirror. If you would like to see a tutorial for that, I'll leave a link to it down below in the description box. And for our third pineapple decor piece, we will take this cute little glass jar I found from the dollar store and embellish the rim of the opening with one round of spoon tips. This one will be a very simple but elegant piece that can be used as a tea light holder. And if you don't have any of the dollar store jars that I'm using, just take a visit to your kitchen and you'll likely find some jam jars, pickle jars, and even juice jars that you can repurpose once they have been emptied out, of course. And here's the final look for our smaller pineapple decor piece. This one can be used as a tea light holder and actually goes very well as a set with the other two pieces we made today. Leave me a comment down below and let me know what you think. In fact, if you have made it this far in today's craft tutorial, how about writing pineapple in the comment section so I know you visit it today. And if you enjoy glam home decor and DIY crafts on a budget, make sure you subscribe to my channel and hit the notification bell so you never miss out on any of my upcoming glam home decor DIYs. And if you liked what you saw today, please give me a thumbs up and check out my other DIY candle holder and vase tutorials.